The tradition of finishing a meal with something sweet originated in France during the 17th century. It's believed that the word derives from the French verb deservir, which means to clear the table before the final course. What started as a simple fruit platter gradually grew to much more elaborate sweet dishes. For example, eclairs, soufflés, crepes, macarons, creme brulee, to name a few, all have origins in France. No surprise, then, that France tops every list when surveys ask consumers which country wins the dessert battle. Desserts are an indulgent comfort, and it is said that we have a separate stomach when it comes to sweets. Science hints that we feel full once we eat a lot of the same kind of food, but when we are presented with dessert options, our appetite is awakened by new and exciting sights, smells, and flavors. A meal is never really complete without dessert. The U.S. is the biggest sugar consumer in the world, but even sweets, when eaten in moderation, can be part of a healthy lifestyle. In the restaurant industry, around 60% of operators offer desserts as a regular part of their menu. Cookies, cupcakes, and ice cream are the top three favorites. Curious which desserts hit the spot around the world? Well, let's begin with France, where pastries are a daily staple. Croissants, profiteroles, and madeleines are among some of the most popular, but macarons are the top dessert of choice. These sweet meringue-based cookies come in all colors, flavors, and sizes, and are now a universal favorite. Tiramisu is the pride of Italy and is loved throughout the world. The name literally means pick-me-up, and with coffee as one of its main ingredients, we can see why. Close by, Spain offers churros as their favorite sweet. One of the oldest desserts, 16th century Spanish explorers brought churros on their adventures and introduced them to the rest of the world. Fried dough sticks, typically rolled in cinnamon sugar and served with a chocolate dipping sauce, are now huge, especially in South America. Looking more to the east, Japan's gluttonous rice balls, more famously known as mochi, are not everyone's cup of tea. Green tea, of course. Desserts were introduced as treats for the imperial family to enjoy alongside their bitter matcha, and things evolved from there. Nowadays, all kinds of flavors, shapes, and fillings are available, with red bean paste being the most popular. As for the Middle East, baklava rules the roost. Though there is much controversy surrounding its origins, Turkey, Greece, ancient Iran, they can all agree that it is their dessert of choice. Made from layers of paper-thin pastry, chopped nuts, and then sweetened with syrup or honey, it's a simple dish which can be enjoyed at any time of day. As for the USA, king of sweet tooths, it has to be s'mores, the simplest of desserts. Two biscuits sandwiched together with melted marshmallows and chocolate. This treat apparently began as scouts gathered around a campfire back in the 1920s, looking for a simple sugar fix. We have only really scratched the surface with these few famous regional delicacies. There are so many more to explore. Lamingtons and Pavlova from Australia, Gulab Jamun from India, Pastéis de nata from Portugal, tres leches from Mexico, waffles from Belgium. Mm -hmm. Actually, let's just skip the main dishes. Slice me a piece of that apple pie. <laughs>